We started? Yes. Oh my god, okay. Like, this is... Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. So, I feel like this video should be more about five makeup essentials that a woman needs before she steps out of the house. I feel like, yo, before you step out of the house, the first thing, you need to have good skin. Ladies, before you say anything, first thing you need is just a good skincare routine. Scrub your face, maybe just once a week. Uh, you need a good uh, face wash. You need a good moisturizer. You should really invest in products that don't have so many chemicals in them. Just so that you save your skin for old age. Uh, you don't want to use products that make you look good now and later in life they catch up with you. I love simple products. I love uh, the brand Simple for skincare. I feel like it doesn't have so many chemicals in it. Yeah, so we jump on to the second thing. You need to at least have a good pair of eyebrows. At least twist them, thread them, you know, uh, just make them look neat. You know, you can use a MAC brow gel if you don't like um, filling in your brows. This MAC product is amazing. You just brush your eyebrows and they stay the same way the whole day. They just stay in that shape the whole day. Another thing, good lip care, man. Good lip care is comes in handy. Uh, if you don't like lipsticks, just do a good lip balm then. The cocoa butter lip balm is amazing. Um, I think it's around 400 shillings. It's awesome. It leaves your lips uh, feeling very, um, very silky. That's what I have now. Scrub your lips. Um, and again, MAC has a good, good, good lip scrub. Um, you should check it out. Or use um, makeup paste with sugar and water and glycerin and just scrub your lips at least once a week also or twice. I do mine twice. So another thing we need is just a good mascara. A mascara opens up the eye. I think women generally struggle with mascara because they take it out of the tube and use it directly. So it leaves um, like clumps of mascara on your, on, your, on your lashes. And then your mascara, th then your lashes look really and So this is what you do uh, with the mascara. Um, so you've dipped the mascara, you just do one wipe with tissue, dry tissue, and then, so it takes the excess off, and then you just, you know, you just do your, your lashes. And I feel like the best way to do your lashes is to, you see, like the way you brush your teeth, you sort of like um, do that and then comb them out. You do that and then you comb out your lashes. I can't really do it um, the way I would wish to, but I hope this helps. So that's how you do your lashes and you do not get so much product on your lashes because also it's very hard to take um, the mascara off your lashes in the evening. And this is one more thing that women don't do um, that I feel like I should point out. Ladies don't take off their mascara um, at night. Um, you might wipe off all the makeup, but you forget the mascara. So you can use some coconut oil to just get that mascara that you did in the morning out of your, 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 your lashes. So ladies, um, one, we need good skin. You really need good skin to walk out of the house. Two, you need a good set of brows. Three, you need a, a good moisturized lips. Four, you need um, a good mascara. You need just, you know, to just brush those babies, and it will make you op It will make those eyes open. Uh, four, five, five, right? Five, you need one of these products. You need either powder, you need um, foundation, or if you're that person who doesn't like makeup at all and you just don't like too much stuff, too much makeup on your, on your face, you need this baby right here. It's a fix plus. And in powder, guys, I really have something to confess. I, there's this sponge that I usually find uh, in most of my powders when I get, say, my MAC uh, powders. This sponge, I've never used it and I've always wanted to use it, so I get a chance to use it today. Um, so I used to see my mom using it and I sort of like, I was so curious to just, 
I never, I used to wonder how it feels, you know, to use this sponge on my face. So at least I get a chance to do this, not judging friends. Um, yeah, so I guess it works if you want to powder your face. Uh, the thing I love about MAC uh, powders is that you can use this, the Studio Fix powder gives you a very good coverage, almost the same as the foundation. So you don't really need these two products um, if you're not looking to just bake your face and look all, you know, look like you have too much product on your face. You can easily use just the powder alone. And what you do, you just, after moisturizing your skin, you just apply some good amount of this powder and it gives you like really good flawless skin. And I feel like all these three products are awesome because you can use all of them together or each one separately. So after these two products or say you're that person who just prefers to do the powder only, you can go ahead and spray your, your, your face um, with a Fix Plus and it sets your makeup sprayed uh, 30 centimeters away and you just do that. And I'm telling you guys, this thing just gives you a glow for days. It, it, it gives you a glow. You walk out of the house like this and you're just ready to receive the sun, you know? Those are the five makeup um, essentials that you need before you step out of the house. So guys, please subscribe to my channel. I would really, really use some more subscribers. Please let me know, let me know what other things we, uh, you would like to see uh, on my channel or what other things you think I should talk about in this channel. And I'll be glad to just read your comments and see how I can be of help to you guys. Awesome.